Hello, and welcome back to me playing that WWE Supercard, my WWE Supercard, Champions of the World. People's Champion has not started. <laughs> it's not that week, Luge. It's Road to Glory, and it started today. Or it has started yesterday for you, because I'm going to upload this sometime tomorrow. So my bouts are full. Oh, King of the Rings finished, and so is my fusion chamber. So let us uh, let's check out and see what goodies we got here. King of the Ring. Standings first. What? I've made it to eighth place? I can't believe it. I can't believe I'm in the blue. It's been a while since I was in the blue, so. Kind of a big deal for me. A little bit excited. A little bit, a little bit. Oh, let's claim rewards. It's an epic. Random epic. John Cena, my boo. Oh, my boo. It's funny, actually, I saw on Twitter today, or yesterday for you guys, that John Cena debuted it in 2002 on today. Well, yesterday, for you guys. Um, versus Kurt Angle on this exact date. So, that was pretty cool to learn that. Fusion Chamber. What do we got here? Give me another John Cena card. Give me another John Cena card. Give me two for the price of one. Bray Wyatt. Alright. I heard, I don't know if it's true, but some of you were telling me that Bray Wyatt is like one of the best legendary fusion cards you can get. Even better than the Brock Lesnar card I have. So if that is true, let me know for sure. Because now I got Bray Wyatt. Look at this. I'm excited. Sister Abigail. Uh, I'm not going to throw him in, but we'll keep him there just like that. And now let's check out Road to Glory. The Usos, Cody Rhodes, Skulldust, Rusev Crush, Mark Henry, Randy Orton, The Viper, Bray Wyatt, Daniel Bryan, and now Roman Reigns. Realistically, where are we going to get up to? I would say Randy Orton. Maybe. More likely Mark Henry. But, you got to get it started. Your deck is invalid. Alright, well let's edit deck. And the easiest way to do this is just autofill. Ooh, what? Legendary plus. Legendary plus just barely to Survivor. Exciting, though. Those are some good cards. So, I mean, this is going to be boring for you guys to watch, I guess. So I won't, I won't have the video that long because, I mean, the, the commons, the uncommons are, are, are simple. I just let my fingers dance on the screen. As I pick cards, like, it, I don't even have to really look. It's no, there's no strategy for the first couple of rounds. You just pick the cards, and you usually just get the wins. It's how, it's how it happens. It's how I roll. So, yeah, the fingers just dance on the screen. The divas get picked, but the only thing is when you're dancing your finger on the screen, you gotta pay attention to if it's a diva or a superstar. Because you don't want to be tapping on a diva to go in, and uh, it doesn't want a diva. It's not a diva's match. Hallelujah. So yeah, easy, and I get my plus six cards, and it's it's ex exciting that my cards are so powerful. I don't know if I'm gonna purchase uh, the title matches. I just don't know how much are they anyway. I should look. I should look into that. Let me know um, if you guys already finished getting both WrestleMania cards. Because some of you are really quick with it. I believe you buy the title matches and you're just like on that grind. A 24-hour grind. But I'm probably just going to play this for a few hours. What time is it? It's about 3.30. Um, until SmackDown starts. And then I might um, play some more after SmackDown. So, by the time this video is uploaded, hopefully I'll I'll be much further along. Just let those fingers dance on the screen. We got the first victory! <laughs> Sorry, I get so excited. Oh, I have eight cards to pick. Yoko! Oh! I picked that by accident. I meant to go back to the top row. Support card. Harper. Maybe we'll get a title match right here. Roman, give me a title. Super card is Jericho. Did you guys watch Tough Enough, by the way? I'm so glad that everyone likes ZZ as much as I do. Like, I didn't I didn't get to watch it at 8 o'clock. I watched the repeat of it at 11. So I wasn't able to even vote for him. 
and I didn't know what happened. I stood off of Twitter, but when I finally got to watch it, I was I was so glad that um, he had an overwhelming response and lots of votes to keep him in tough enough because I would have voted for him too. I just like him. I like his personality. I like his attitude. Um, and, and he never gave up during during that challenge, you know, and it was tough for him. I mean, I just think of myself out there trying to carry my body weight and running up all those stairs. It's tough. So I gave him credit. He finished it too. Never give up. Hustle, loyalty, respect, and nothing but respect for that kid. And he's young too. He was like 18 years old. They all went to bars. That was the funniest episode. Can we, let's talk about the episode while I'm playing this. If you guys watched it, definitely leave down in the comments below who's your favorite. Um, I like I like a lot of them. I haven't picked a favorite yet. Like, I like Tanner. He won the challenge. And um, I like his attitude, too. I like that he's a little, you know, cocky and, like, get on my level kind kind of guy. Um, but what else? Oh, ZZ is hilarious. His commentary while in the hot tub. <laughs> I was dying. He's like, this is like a sausage soup. We need some... We need some spices, and that's when the girls came <laughs> for the stew. I don't know. Then he took off his undies. That was a little too much, but I still thought it was so funny. He is a funny character for sure. I can't wait to watch next week's episode. But you know what I didn't watch? I didn't watch Tough Talk with The Miz. I actually, I saw a couple of um, like clips of it on YouTube. But, oh, my book bag fell. That's just scared the bejesus out of me. Um, but yeah, I think I gotta watch Tough Talk. So I could get to know the competitors even more. Cesaro. Gold Dust. Oh, an ultra rare. Look at him. Daniel Bryan. Don't you know, pump it up. You've got to pump it up. And don't you know, pump it up. You've got to pump it. Sorry. That was me getting all like Italiano on you, you know? I was getting all Italian. Pumping my fingers up in the sky. Otunga. Rey Mysterio. Let's do one more. Let's do one more match. I mean, let's just finish out the commons. Go. Always go for those plus fives. I always go for them. And Road to Glory. Yeah, and I don't start using my support cards until maybe like Super Rare or, um, or Epics. You know? I don't really need support cards for the easier, the beginning common cards at all. I'm sure you guys don't either. Probably just telling you stuff you already know. Dean Ambrose. Come on, baby. Daniel Bryan, we took out a Daniel Bryan. Maybe I'll work on another fusion, um... Legendary. Well, I gotta start from from commons, but eventually it'll get to uh, legendary. You know, just want to build up a whole bunch. So this way, when I get, I mean, I'm in the survivor tier, but I only have one survivor card, Daniel Bryan. As soon as I get started getting more, I definitely want to make uh, survivor fusion cards, since those will be much stronger than just the regular survivor card. But I'm not ready to part with that one Daniel Bryan survivor card I have. And plus he's already maxed out. I'm not. I'm not tossing him in there for nothing. But it doesn't look like I'll get any picks from. From here. From Road to Glory for Survivor. Since I'm only in the Legendary Plus tier. And um, I like to pick the cards from this. Because I w I'm looking to get title matches. And I, I won't get them in just like the regular exhibition. So. That's my thinking process on it. We're throwing my diva. Diva loves Vegas. Booyah. Big boys on campus. Yeah, I would like to see a big show Bray Wyatt feud. I would enjoy that. Man, Tyson Kidd, I hope he gets well soon, man. I already miss seeing him in the ring. Boom! One, two, three, count them up, lay them out. It's time for the tap out. Picking my cards, get my plus five. I also get that Jay Uso card. Uso's fine. <laughs> and move on to Jimmy Us. Alright, let's see what we get here. Give me something good to work with. Batista. Us. Brock. Ooze. 
Oh man, I, ah, I reached car limit too, but I got all the ooses. All the ooses. Alright, I think I'll end this video with me starting up the next fusion chamber. Go all the way to the beginning. And here we go, I'll throw in you. 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 15 minutes, and yeah, we'll just start up the whole process all over again. And uh, for King of the Ring, I'll show you the cards that I've been working with. So here's my main team with the Brock Lesnar, Batista. I don't think I think I've showed you guys this actually in the last video, but um, on the bench, it's just the Brock Lesnar team that I have, which I think is pretty funny to have. So I'm gonna begin King of the Ring right now. But for you guys, it would have been done already because it was yesterday, but it's today. <laughs> anyway, guys, thanks so much for checking out the video. I'm gonna play some more uh, Road to Glory. And uh, hopefully by the time you see this video, I'll be much further along. Thanks so much again. Uh, definitely will keep you updated on Supercard, Immortals, WWE 2K Mobile, WWE 2K15, Clash of Clans video coming soon. And am I missing anything? Maybe. And even the Luge Mania button. See you guys in the next one.